Okay guys, I'm just going to show you how to quickly navigate and edit some documents and just show you some of the power of uh, SharePoint as well. So what I'm going to do is just going to go find a document to edit and what it'll do is it's going to open it in just a read-only mode and it acts like Excel so you've got file up there, you've got a few other options here. But what you really want to do is um, and it acts like just like a normal normal spreadsheet you've got tabs down the bottom but what you want to do is go edit workbook and make sure you go edit an Excel web app now this is going to give you the power of Excel just in your browser um, and you've got all your normal things up the top there formulas and everything like that now what I'm going to do is I've just grabbed someone else's SharePoint and I'm just going to log in to the same file as them so here I go this is someone's I've borrowed. Thank you, Emma. So I'm just going to do the same thing. Add an Excel web app. And what you can see here is someone else is also editing. Uh, so this gives you a simultaneous editing of the document. And um, if I scroll down, I'm just going to pick a cell. I'm going to go back to my SharePoint. And, you can, and I can see Emma's editing this. And she's blue and I'm red. And there's Emma's cell there, so if I saw Emma in that cell, I wouldn't go into the same cell and start editing that one as well. Um, so if we go back to mine, we can see that, uh, oh no, sorry, that's Emma's, there I am in red. And once you're finished, just click uh, Agency Leader SharePoint at the top. There's no save button, it saves automatically and the last person out is the last person to edit it. As you can see, it tells me it's just me in this document. Um, and I'm going to finish up here and just click Agents Leader SharePoint. So no no saving, no nothing. And um, that's, that's the power of it. So you don't have to worry about conflicted copies anymore. And it's always going to be the latest version no matter what.